Hey folks, this is Rachel Parker with Resonance Social Media, and today I'm coming to you with a book review of Launch, How to Quickly Propel Your Business Beyond the Competition. This is a book by Mike Stelzner, who is the founder of SocialMediaExaminer.com. Now, if you follow me on Twitter, you'll know that I share a ton of content from Social Media Examiner, just because uh, they always have such great stuff to say. It's very practical, usable content for um, for businesses of all sizes. Love, love, love what they put out there. So this is a book that uh, Mike recently released, and it's a really excellent resource for, um, say, business owners, marketing strategists, or other uh, marketing professionals who really want to uh, take their business to the next level when it comes to things like content marketing and, um, and social media engagement. Great resource. Um, First of all, I want to talk about what this book is not. It's not a primer on um, social media for business. So if you're looking for a one-on-one on, -one on 101, 101 on how to set up a Facebook page or how to get followers on Twitter, um, this is not the resource that you're looking for. What it is is a practical guide to creating and publishing quality content and engaging your um, your ecosystem in a way that can promote your business to your next level and help you achieve your goals in social media. Um, look at my notes here, sorry. So the basic principle behind launch is the elevation principle. And it's a very cool little formula, very simple. It's GC plus OP minus MM equals G. Now, what does that mean? It means great content plus other people minus marketing messages equals growth. And a lot of the book is spent on uh, touching on those different elements of that elevation principle and talking about why each step in that equation is so important. So great content, he talks about things like uh, solving problems, uh, earning trust in your expertise, and then other people would be engagement with other experts uh, in your field and kind of in, in complementary fields and also with influencers, um, other bloggers out there on the web who already have a great following, people that can um, you can engage with to help you achieve your goals. And then my favorite part of the equation is minus MM, which is marketing messages. Uh, you may have heard me say that I hate the term social media marketing because from my perspective, you go into social media with a marketing mindset, then you're already off the mark and you're not going to um, get out of it all that you could be getting out of it. So, um, and what he talks about, you've got to have marketing messages, but there's a time and a place for them. And what he talks about is caging them. Um, you know, kind of like you would cage an animal, um, just knowing that there is an appropriate time and an appropriate place, but not everywhere and all the time. And um, and he goes into how, how you can do that on a practical level. So another thing that I enjoy about this book is it told me a little bit about the background of Social Media Examiner. Um, like I said, it's one of my favorite sites, but I didn't know that much about it. It started in October 2009, and one thing that I found absolutely fascinating is that Mike was committed to achieving 10,000 subscribers to Social Media Examiner before he sold a single thing, and that included ad space. So he started off with that really powerful commitment to giving away the good stuff, giving away advice, uh, solving problems that people need solutions to, things like that. And in not a whole lot of time, they became the one of the world's top two social media sites, second only to Mashable. Um, and it's a pretty impressive success story, and it was really fun to see how they did that. Um, and as I mentioned, one of the things I love about Social Media Examiner is that the advice there is so practical, and that very much carries through in Mike's book. It's very practical advice. Uh, he provides a lot of case studies, a lot of illustrations, and uh, really takes you through the process. Um, chapters two and three are based on uh, putting together a mission plan 
for your organization. Then the next few articles, excuse me, articles, chapters, he talks about engaging outside experts. He talks about uh, engaging content, really getting in there and, and creating content that's really going to engage people and get them, get them to trust you and to have faith in your expertise so that when the time does come to release that marketing messages, there's already that relationship in place. And then he talks about, he devotes an entire chapter to that caging of marketing messages that I talked about a minute ago. Really, really good stuff. And also in the appendices, he provides real world examples of these different kinds kinds of content that can help your business, the how-to article, the expert interview, things like that. So excellent book. I highly recommend it. And um, if you don't have socialmediaexaminer.com bookmarked, go bookmark it right now because it's really an excellent resource. But first, make sure that you read Mike's book. Speaking of which, I have one copy of Launch to give away to uh, someone watching this um, this video right now. And what I would like to know is, okay, so we just passed the halfway mark for 2011. We're now in the second half of the year. And what I challenge you to do is go back and look at the social media goals that you set for your business or your organization at the beginning of the year and tell me about what you can commit to launching between now and the end of the year. It might be a blog if you don't have one already. It might be a YouTube series. It might be a webinar series. Let me know what you're interested in launching and what your ideas are around that and um, submit your response in the comments down below and on this Friday, July 29th, I will go through and pick the best response and give this copy of launch to um, the best response that I find. So uh, leave a note in the comments and um, let me know what you're going to be launching between now and the end of the year to get your very own copy of launch. That is it for me today. This is Rachel Parker reporting from Mission Control here at Resonance. Wish you a wonderful day and we'll talk to you again soon.